My name is Paul Kenny. I'm the director of the Drug Discovery Institute, which is trying to understand the, uh, the basic neurobiology of drug addiction um, and other compulsive disorders. The substance that we're most interested in from an addiction perspective is nicotine. Tobacco smoking is perhaps the leading cause of premature death and disease in the United States. Uh, it's one of the major growing causes of morbidity worldwide. You're much more likely to develop a habit if you use nicotine compared to other major drugs of abuse. But we think it's really critical to understand how the brain chooses and why the brain chooses to consume certain substances, how that type of decision is being influenced, and when those decisions appear to become almost automatic and beyond the control of the individual. We actively seek targets in the brain that can influence maladaptive behaviors like compulsive nicotine use, cocaine use, overeating, and try to develop new drugs based on that information and ultimately, with some luck, uh, advance them into human clinical trials to see if we can develop new medications. I guess it's the uh, thrill of the hunt. Even gaining modest insight into an aspect of these really complex brain processes is incredibly exciting. We try not to lose sight of the fact that its humans are impacted and help those who suffer from addiction. Every day, every week, we're getting that one step closer.